Dave and Birdie. She knows which way they are. Where they at? Easy. 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 Right underneath that cedar. Oh yeah. Get ready. Yes, sir, Graham. That's the way, that's the way you do it. Oh, easy. Easy. Yeah. That's a bird. Let's go, boys. Yeah, yeah. That's what I'm talking about. You shooting, Graham? Pop the chair. Yeah, now, now it rolls. Now it's just, now it's just flowing. Betty knows how to find them. Yes, sir. Let's go, crap. <laughs> I know. Such a cool looking bird, boy. There we go. <laughs> Sleepy time. There it is, Pat. Got him! <laughs> oh, you got that. <laughs> I dang near could have caught that thing. I know, he came right at you. <laughs> what a pretty bird, boys. You know about where that was at. They run on. I didn't want to. I saw it down right in front of that bush. Hey! Good girl, buddy. Can't beat this. Can't beat this. I know. Perfect. It's a little warmer. Yeah. <laughs> no, I'm not terrible.
<laughs> shooting. Got it. <laughs> Let's go, baby. I think you nicked him on the first one. Yeah, he turned. Looks like he dropped a little bit. Bird in here, come on. Shot it. <laughs> <laughs> I think you got it. Let's go, Maverick. Hit him at the last shot. <laughs> She's running around up there. Oh, this is on one right up here. She's on one? Straight up ahead. Oh, yeah. Go That one just popped out. Yeah. I think Hunter got that one, or you. Yeah. <laughs> Let's go. My goodness. <laughs> that buddy Did you get it? yeah buddy hey yeah. let off it buddy buddy hey let go good girl buddy Come on. may still be oh my goodness I saw guts like 
Surely it's there. Yeah, we hit her somewhere. You got that one. <laughs> I told you I'm shooting. <laughs> yes, sir. There you go. Pepper that one. That didn't go into the bush, right? Oh, good. Good girl, buddy. Ooh. Woo -hoo -hoo. Love killing birds, boys. Roger that. They are go. No celebration. Let's go, baby. Did you hit that one? I don't know. We kind of hit one. Pap shot it. Yeah, I shot at it. You shot at it. You and me hit that last shot at the same time, so it probably mixed. Heck yeah. Yes, sir. Great day out. It was a little cold start. Wind's dying down. Um, we're looking for the quail that we missed the first time around. I'm not sure if we hit it the first time, if it's dead, if we just didn't hit it at all. I really don't know. But we're out here having a great time. Just shooting in boys. Probably just a live update of another quail getting popped. Or a bunch of quail on the track, but catch up with you. see we have the finished grounded process of the high quality quail. 
<coughs> and we're going to attempt something that we have never seen done before, which is a quail burger. If you look up quail burger on Google, there is absolutely no help whatsoever. So this is a blind process. And we'll see how it goes. Grills up to 10. It's time to season. Now, we weren't really sure how to season our quail burgers, so we're just gonna go at it like we would a normal burger. We're gonna start out with some ducks as our base layer. We're just gonna put a nice coating on here. Look at the precision. Mama me. We're gonna go with some Himalayan pink salt. And to top it off, a little bit of a Cajun dusting. Give her a little bit of zest. Love our Cajun spices. R.I.P. Cajun burger is steak and shake. Yes, I have no idea why they took that off the menu. And now, we're gonna flip her over and do the exact same thing. What a beautiful process. I really hope these are fire. I do too. Like we said, it's we've never seen it. <laughs> it's done, not so on Google. It's kind of scary. We don't know what to expect. There may be a reason people don't have tutorials for this kind of thing. If you guys have never tried that buck seasoning, go show Mr. Andrew Flair some love. Cause, he, I mean, he probably didn't come up with what's inside of that. But man, whoever did is just a genius. <laughs> He oh. sells it. Mm. Okay. <laughs> Girls hot. Girls hot. <laughs> Get that non-stick absorber power of the butter. Here we go. It even sounds different hitting the grill than beef. Well. <laughs> I guess we just wait and find out. <laughs> I guess all we can do at this point is wait. Alright then. <laughs> <laughs> it's an angel! They're looking fire, boys. I was, I was not gonna lie, I was pretty skeptical of <laughs> how it would look after first flip. They're but looking I'm, pretty fire. I'm not disappointed. No, not at all. A little lighter, lighter brown than beef gonna go ahead and treat it like chicken to where you should probably cook it all the way through. Yeah, we don't want any of that salmonella. <laughs> they look a little bit dry. It's gonna take a little bit more butter. It's very controversial, but I like a lot of butter on my burgers. It really helps add to the juiciness. Uh, well, let at least cook a little bit. Hold on. Let's make your cheese decision. My cheese decision. Your cheese decision. Show me my cheese options. Your cheese options. Wide variety. Hey, people like to know what you have in your fridge. <laughs> people like to know. So, There's a so let's look. Ah, okay. What do you want to, where do you want to start? You want to start top shelf? Yeah, sure. Okay. Well, for one, I found a new flavor of Zero Sugar Monsters, which I like my caffeine. <laughs> and then these, um... We don't talk about this. Right here, we got... <laughs> <laughs> we, we don't talk about this. We got peach preserves. Yeah. There's some salsa back there. And then for some reason, my brother ordered... I think it was either five or ten pounds of this shredded Fiesta blend cheese, so I got a lot of that. And then second shelf, we got we got our breakfast items. We got our bacon, our eggs. We got some OJ back there. Um, sweet tea, which I don't like sweet tea. Carson doesn't like sweet tea, so it just sits there. <laughs> um, we got some milk. Should be expiring tomorrow. <laughs> You're gonna have to pound that after after dinner. Cottage cheese, some bread and butter pickles, some Panera mac and cheese. Shit's fire, boy. <laughs> Second show. We got... Ah. Drinks. Capri Sun. It's for uh, our little boat driver, Colton. <laughs> if you haven't seen that video, 
Go watch that. Check it out. He's a pretty bad boat driver. He's awful. And then we got uh, my great aunt made some made some pies. I kind of ate most of them, but <laughs> we have one coconut cream pie left. Fire. And then we got drinks. We got water, Dr. Pepper, another monster. We got two red Gatorades. Also, if you refer to Gatorades as anything but their color, you're wrong. <laughs> then we got some hard sodas down there. Um, we got old Ferb snack items. <laughs> Hot dogs. Uh, some more bread and butter. These are spicy. Pretty good. Hazelnut spread. I've never had it. Don't try it. <laughs> we have our condiments. We have ketchup. We got jelly. We got lemon juice. We got cinnamon rolls. We got barbecue sauce. Liquid aminos. If you like soy sauce and you meal prep your chicken, this is it, boys. It's got a bunch of a different amino acids in there. Soy sauce, liquid smoke, Worcestershire sauce. Washed it. <laughs> and then just some random necessities. Ooh, baby. But, jeez. We got American. Or we got Colby and Monterey. You know, just give me that American cheese, you know. That's what I'm going I on. I killed the quail in America, so it only seems right. It just seems right. We're supporting America in multiple ways, and we're also supporting mm. Carson's father. Craft. <laughs> Craft forever, baby. Let's see these. Oh, baby. It's time for a flip. I like to see that the sides don't look raw anymore. That's it's a great sight. I'm really bad at judging the doneness of things without cutting into them, so we'll have to give her a few more minutes and let her <laughs> see how she goes. We'll go ahead and prep our buns to be toasted. If you don't toast your buns, you're also doing dinner wrong. Toasting the bun. I'm Tell me that's not just a perfectly done. Ooh, look at that shine. I guess I grabbed three plates. <laughs> Furby, you making two? He says if I can. But they should be done. Which one you want? I want I'll take the one I cut into. Okay. <laughs> I don't really care. Either way. Shoosh. Very excited. Optimistic. I mean, just it's a fire. Just, mm -hmm. And I mean, I made it, so I know it's. Expectations. Burgers are done. They're looking pretty fire, boys. Um, back in the chair for a, a test review. Put some ketchup on the side, you know, because I like to dip the ketchup. No, I just have it gush out, but this is the moment of truth, boys. Let's see how she tastes. Tastes like chicken. The taste buds are confused. <laughs> I need to go back in. Uh oh. I honestly have no idea what to say. It's exceptional, like taste. Phenomenal, but I don't know if it tastes like chicken or beef. What? It tastes like quail. <laughs> I mean, like like, quail. <laughs> I don't know. It's like very distinct. It tastes like itself. Look in that. Perfectly cooked. Oh, it is. Perfectly cooked, as normally is by Young Maverick. But yeah, dude, these are fire. <laughs> like, love these things. Especially with ketchup. Seasoning, perfect. 
Everything's everything's solid. I give it eight point five out of ten. Really, dude, they're fire. You need to try them. <laughs> hmm. All right, we're swapping places now. Maverick examining his burger. I'm gonna Maverick opt for the. Uh, I'm gonna opt for no ketchup just because I I myself have never had quail, so I wanted to see. Well, you know, just like that raw flavor is. Raw flavor without ketchup. <laughs> I have one sentence. Why the hell is this not on Google? <laughs> <laughs> They're good. Like... Bro, they're fire. This is... This should be just like a recipe, people. Like, bird hunters. If you hunt quail... Yes, bro. Put this through the grinder. However much you end up with, just like estimate about 10% of pork fat and just grind it in there. And this... This this will change the way that you cook quail. What did we get? We got... We uh, took home like 14 birds. 14 birds, and it came out to like about two and a half pounds of ground meat. So how many patties do you think we'll have all together with 14 birds? I'd say we can probably make like eight total burgers. Dang, that's not bad. That's not bad at all. They're, they're hefty sized burgers too, boys. I mean, look at them. It's a big old chunk out of it. Still got quite but a bit to go. I'm very impressed. Same I, here. Like, I really am. And I don't want to just eat this whole thing on camera in front of you guys. <laughs> but if you have stayed for this long, I hope you enjoyed me absolutely demolishing the quail <laughs> right in front of me <clears throat> my cooking expertise which hopefully will change your life and of course subscribing to this channel sir thank you guys and we'll see you next time